Hello and welcome to Sonic the Hedgehog 2. It is so good to be back. Sorry I haven't been active all this time. I've been gone in a while. So I have a lot to tell you of why I haven't been so active all this time. That is because I have found myself a job as a testing clerk at a college. Yes, that is why I haven't made any videos all this time. I was just trying to find a simple job just to help myself support all that stuff and whatever. And yeah, I was supposed to do this during the time of Sonic the Hedgehog the movie was released, but again, I haven't been active. But enough said, I'm back and I'm going to play myself some games. So if you want to support this channel, be sure to press the notification button subscribe and like so with that said let's get into the sequel also at a side note i am planning to release a new channel which is exclusively for long game plays or full game if you want to call it that way so with that said let's begin Sega. and right off the bat we are already playing this and we're introduced with a new character called Miles Tail, a two-tailed fox and Sonic's companion. Let me just check something real quick. So you have two options. You can play as Sonic or Tails. And Tails, excuse me. Or alone with Sonic or Tails. However you want to do it, it doesn't make any difference. We're just going to go try this out as both companion. And right off the bat, you have Tails with you. So again, um, I was supposed to do this during the release of the movie, but I was too busy with my studies. And I really do not like that monkey, which I believe is called Coconuts, just like in the cartoon at the time and this is also the first Sega game that I ever played it was actually my brother's birthday gift we never played the first one because this was was more popular and I'm trying my best to avoid not getting hit or lose my rings to stay focused and I already messed up it's a lot monkey and we have ourselves this checkpoint thing you hit it and you save your progress and there's also a reason why this is important because that checkpoint will lead you to a bonus place And I will show you because right now I'm too focused of not messing up. And there it is. And there's another one and you'll see a star jump up and it leads you to a bonus area a racing place so you're gonna have to get all the rings like 40 rings as an example it's pretty simple just get as much ring as you can till you get the chaos emerald and when I was young I never liked this because it kind of scared me and I already got a perfect one now I've progressed to the 80 ring I think the reason why it scared me is because of the 3D design and this progress that's that how you say or it's 3D render I don't know 
And I really don't like the music of this as well. I always keep avoiding when I was young, so yeah. And I got the first Chaos Emerald, so there's going to be more of this soon, but it's going to be more harder even when you progress. And I already wasted all the rings, so you're going to have at least 50 rings to, in order to open this. And the more rings you collect, I mean... The more you do this, the more harder it gets. I got myself an extra life. And I lost some rings. It's a lot B or whatever those things are. And there's another checkpoint thing. Now let's see if we can try to get up there without getting hit. And I'll show you an example how to... of the race progress. As soon as I try to get up there perfectly. And I as well as trying to avoid that monkey. This is gonna be a toughie to get through. And yes, I have been done this in a while so I'm not going to be speaking or I'm just going to mess up with my words. There we go. And we're on to the next one. So now we're on to the next race and it's going to be more harder this time. So like I said the more Chaos Emerald you get, the more harder it gets. And I know that there's more background noises in that. Because right now it's messing me up. But I just want to show you something, just in case. I'm just going to mess this up on purpose, just to get an idea on what happened if you don't get it all the rings. Not enough rings, so you're gonna have to find another one to start over. So let's try this again and see if we can do this better. So yeah, I've gotten a new job in college campus as a testing clerk or proctor. It was not too long ago, so I've never been active of doing my videos. Tails is just going to mess me up because he's just losing my ring, so that's the reason why I never play him. And 
And I already got another. So, I don't think I'll be doing too many of this. We're just gonna keep on going best we can. And we're done with the first part of the first level. I really cannot speak today, so sorry about my dialogue. Just stuttering and all that. It's been a while since I've done this anyway, so yeah. up in that. So again, I'm not going to be too crazy about this, trying to get all the rings just for this. And already I messed up. try doing one more. If I don't do it good, then I'll just keep on going. Ooh, that was a close one. It doesn't matter if I get this or not. This is going to be a let's try or let's play video anyway, so I probably might do this when I release the my new channel full of long plays and all that. But for now, we're close to the first boss, and it's none other than Eggman himself, Jim Carrey. No, it's just Robotnik. And just like in the first game, keep hitting him eight times until he dies or something like that. I can't tell how much you have to hit him. I 
guessing that's four. And be careful, that thing over there, the drills, is going to pop out of the car. Just like that. And just like that, he's already defeated. And he's going to fly away until next level. But at least we've freed all the animals from his trap, so we're moving on to the next level. Chemical plant zone. So just like before, keep going to the next area. Up. I remember this level too well. And I gotta be careful not to take it too long. Stay too long in the spider when it grabs me because it'll explode. Yeah, that's a lot of mess me up. Okay, so I'm gonna have to skip this part because that was just pointless. I don't want to go through that. Let's try to continue on to the area. I just want to point out as well that the new Super Mario movie trailer is coming out next week next Thursday or whatever so I shouldn't be mentioning this in a Sonic review and we've made it to the end of the finish line of the first part of the second level Gotta go fast in order to get to this. Tails is just following me. Helicopter tail. Even if you lose her, him, excuse me, it just continues on. And this is the part I remember. If I just fall into the water, I gotta find my way back up. And as an example, just to show you what happens if I don't, if I fall off or die. And 
and already been crushed. That's another way to die. In fact, this is the first time when I first do this level, this is the first time I was struggling to get through this part. Let's just take our time, wait for this to come without any crush. There we go. And yes, if you stay in the water too long, you will drown. start over again. And I gotta hurry up before I drown. Countdown. Made it. There we go. I just have to edit that part out. quick and now we have another robotic boss fight so he's just collecting all the water and just shooting at me with it turning it into ice I don't know and already we beat him simple Still running away as usual. But who cares? We already freed all the animals. So on to the next level. Aquatic Ruins. I think this is the same one from the last game. This is probably one of my favorite levels. We got ourselves Grounder. Another character from the cartoon. At first I always thought that was a turkey, but no. careful not to hit these Darth or get touched by those Darth because they'll hit you. Yeah, I can't speak. And be careful there are these piranha things, shark or whatever they are. There it is. Give me the air. I keep forgetting that I need to get these giant bubbles for more air. And we made it to the finish line. Pretty quick. That was a close one. Or not. Somehow I'm gonna have to finish this video real soon. Because it's almost about been a minute, 30 minutes, excuse me. It seems pretty longer than the last Let's Play.
that was weird. But it just showed you the I mean, animation of what happened if I drown. And I messed up again. new location to get to the surface instead of go to the water because this is getting a bit pointless and every time I get a air from the bubble the music repeats starts over again And I'm dead. On purpose. I can't see through these bushes. I don't know how that was possible, but... I went down or some sort of glitch. Stupid grounder. Now we're in the third boss fight of Robotnik. It's just gonna hit us with the arrow by smashing the totem pole thing. So now I'm back here. Let's try this again. <sighs> this is taking way too long. Well, that was a close one. And I'm already wasting my rings again. Seems to be a pretty faster let's play, despite how quick I'm beating the level. Casino night. So this is the other level that I remember being too long, but I really love the way the level looks. It's wider and more colorful almost have the Las Vegas vibe because it's actually a casino based level and we got ourselves the chili dogs here as I think it is and this part I remember is the slot machine if 
If you just get a matching pair, then you get more rings. No! Let's try this again. I'm sure I have one more life, but that's fine. We're just gonna quit this if that happens again. Not this time. And this is actually also the level that I keep getting lost the most when I was young. Trying to block yourself? I don't think so. Actually, this also reminds me of a pinball version of Sonic. That reminds me of that. Wait, are they promoting... I don't know what kind of brand of shoe it is, but I see the symbol. So we made it to the finish line. And I had to silence it because of that. And it looks like Sonic is in that window. Pretty cool. There's too much noise going on in the background. Did that on purpose just to end this video real quick but I'm trying to do my best to continue on almost there to the end of the level You know what? Just give me a moment, please. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. Well, that was a close.
calls one. died. I just did that on purpose just to end this video, so sorry about that. And sorry for the long silence because I had to silence the video because the more noises in the background. Well, there you have it. That concludes the video for today. So sorry that I made this video too silent at times and all that, but I will continue on. If I ever do, I'll just put it in my long gameplay channel on my other one real soon that I will release. So thank you for watching this video and sorry as well for the lack of dialogue and stutter and all that. It's been a while, but I will continue to do more real soon. So again, if you like this video, be sure to give it a like and a thumbs up. So until then, I will see you again in the next project. <laughs>